In terms of uh, music, it is very uh, big, you can say, conflicted issue. Uh, disagreement is very huge, okay? And obviously the disagreement went to the extension of making takfir of each other. Saying you are not believer, you don't believe in God, you know? So only because of uh, saying music haram or halal, straight away you deny existence of God. It is big claim, okay? But again, we do have... Um, mentally non-stable scholars and we had them all the time in the past also so they have to give them type of uh, just uh, you can say psychological or academic terror either you accept me or either you go to the hell so them type of uh, so that's why getting engaged into this um, issue um, uh, if a scholar has good influence he has to get engaged into it just to clarify because we have mashallah uh, a few gangs of muslims here the they're giving really hard time to Muslims, you know, because of small disagreements. Okay, so um, if there are some influential Muslim uh, authorities, personalities, they have to get engaged to stop this, uh, you can say, friction for nonsense. Okay, anyway, Quran is totally silent about the prohibition of music. I can challenge anyone. Okay, they m mention two verses, but after twisting them. For example, Allah says, وَمِنَ النَّاسِ مَنْ يَشْتَرِي لَهُ وَالْحَدِيثِ لِيُضِلَّ بِهِ عَنْ سَبِيلِ اللَّهِ The meaning of the ayah is there are among the people, some people who, who buy لَهُ الْحَدِيثِ لَهُ in Arabic language means game, playing. Hadith is speech, statement. So that, so that some of the people, they buy just a game, like a verbal game, literal meaning of it, okay? to misguide the people from the path of God. The reason of, the, um, uh, of this uh, verse was uh, when Prophet Muhammad came and he started preaching in Mecca, uh, he was very attractive. Quran was very attractive for the people. They were just amazed. So Qurayshis, they felt a threat for the trading because they used to trade by the names of these idols. But this new prophet is calling to worship only one God and to not to worship the sculptures. Okay, so then one of them he knew Persian language. Okay, anyway he went to Persia and he bought a books about the legend of uh, Rustum and Isfandiyar. You know them, just uh, uh, stories of the kings and stories of heroism of the kings. Okay, so he bought it and brought and as soon, whenever Prophet would uh, recite Quran, so people would come. So he would come to, next to the Prophet saying, Oh people, don't go to him, just come to me, I will read better stories, legend, myths. Okay, so then Ayah came down. And this is verbal, verbal you can say, uh, game. Uh, for example, all of them legends, does not have any basis, uh, does not have any reality. Okay, so mashallah, uh, some of the group of scholars, they use this verse to say it means music. Lahu al-Hadith in Arabic language never meant music. Not in the future, not now, I mean, and not in the past. Never it meant uh, music. Music is al-ghina, ghina, okay, ughnia, okay. And also musiqa also in Arabic language. But lahu al-hadith, it never meant uh, music. And also um, in different, uh, also they bring this another verse uh, in which uh, uh, Allah says, afamin أَفَمِنْ هَذَا الْحَدِيثِ تَضْحَكُونَ وَلَا تَبْكُونَ وَأَنْتُمْ سَامِدُونَ Okay, so in here, uh, Allah says, because of this verse, you are blindly laughing and uh, not crying. Okay, so they say in here, سَامِدُونَ means listening to the music. Okay, سَامِد in Arabic language never meant music. Okay, um, it is only interpretation of few tabain, and tabain are not gods, and they're not prophets. They can they can make mistakes also. Okay, so anyway, um, uh, but from other side also, um, the scholars who say that music is halal, they also used few verses. For me, one of the verses actually very, very reasonable. Anyway, but in my own understanding, music it was such widespread in Arabia in that time. So if it would be prohibited, that is leading you to the hell. So we had to have very clear and obvious verses and ahadith, hundreds of them. Okay, so anyway, so it's big conflict. But that is from one side. And the other side, in terms of qawali, qawali is music. 
know any difference. Just by mentioning the name of God, music is not going to become, uh, for example, prayer. All of that is music. So the one who says, Qawali is halal, has to say music is halal also.